Okay, part two, um, analyzing graphs of polynomial functions. It says when a function rises and falls over an interval, this is called a turning point. But more specifically, I want you to realize when it's rising and then falling, that's a maximum. It depends on what your textbook says. Um, all of them are different. It could say local maximum. It could say extrema. It could say extreme. It could say local maxima. It just depends on the textbook. Um, but when it says local, it's because your graph could have a ton of these. So it's just one of the many. That's what kind of like the local means. Um, when a function falls and then rises, so that would be like this, then this has a local minima or a relative minima. Um, like I said, it's just depending on your textbook. So the points on the graph of the polynomial function that correspond to a local min maxima um, or a local minima or a relative maximum or a relative minimum, these are called turning points. I think your textbook calls them extremes or extrema. Okay, so that's what it's referring to, the highs and lows. Functions can change from increasing to decreasing or from decreasing to increasing at these turning points. So there could be many of them. If you look at the examples, like here's two, here's two, there could be five, there could be 10, okay? We're just keeping it simple though, as we're learning about them. Um, so not only are there turning points, but at the turning points, the intervals change. So we have increasing, decreasing. So if they ask for the interval of increasing, and if the book were to ask you the interval of decreasing, this is how you would notate it. So increasing, you are increasing, okay, the whole time from left to right, but from where? So if you look at the X values, let's just call this five to give you a better frame of reference. They wanna know increasing is the output, increasing is the Y. They wanna know the X values when you're increasing. So you increased all the way up to five. Four, you were increasing. At three, you were increasing. At two, at one, all the way down. So from negative infinity up until the number five, you were increasing. And then that means that from five all the way to infinity, you were decreasing. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, you're going lower and lower. So you ask for the X values since these represent the Y's. Here, from left to right, it's like a roller coaster. You're increasing, then you're decreasing, then you're increasing from left to right. So they want the intervals. Here's the thing, I had one turning point, I had two intervals. I have three intervals, I have two turning points. I have three intervals, I have two turning points. If I were to have four intervals, I would have one less, three turning points. So however many intervals you have, you have one less turning points, okay? So here, from infinity, negative infinity, so like say negative 10, you'd have an, an output. Negative five, you'd have an output down here. But you'd be increasing as you go higher. Okay, so you're increasing from negative infinity. We're just going to start from negative infinity. Okay, all the way to what x value? Zero, because we're not talking about the y's, we're just talking about the x's. So you're increasing from negative infinity to zero. Well, if you stopped at zero, that must mean the next interval is decreasing. So now from zero, you are decreasing as you go left to right you are decreasing from zero to two, and then hop back up. You're increasing from two to infinity. Now you have to put U for union. It's like an and symbol. So like in Spanish, when you write Y for and, it's like U for and, but it means union joining, okay? Here, increasing, decreasing. So actually from 
left to right, you're decreasing, but here you're constant and then you're increasing. That's fine. So from left to right, if you go over here, from negative infinity all the way to negative one, you're decreasing. And then from negative one all the way to one, you're in a constant state. And then from one onward, you're increasing. And that's it.